Ladies and gentlemen, first I would like to share this fantastic feeling to be back with you. I had a terrible accident last time during our experiments, but I survived. Everything is okay. We just had to change a bit design of our safety glasses, but I have the new forces and with even more persistency I would like to continue my mission. Good. This is the place where the accident happened. Um, but so we realized that last time we didn't um, explain you what the mission is. Ladies and gentlemen, we as human species created an incredible invention, which is, uh, we call it also affection. It's, it's love, it's the feeling of love. It does not exist anywhere in the universe beside Earth. So ladies and gentlemen, we decided to share, share love with outer species. Maybe we start from first defining what we mean by love. Love is the most spectacular, indescribable, deep, euphoric feeling for someone. Love is an incredibly powerful word. When you are in love, you always want to be together. And when you are not, you are thinking about being together because you need that person. And without them, you, your life is incomplete. This love is unconditional affection with no limits or conditions. Completely loving someone. It's when you trust the other with your life and when you would do anything for each other. When you love someone, you want nothing more than for them to be truly happy, no matter what it takes, because that is how much you care about them and because their need come before your own. <laughs> yes. Love. You know, I think we all know what is love about. So we decided to share this feeling and build our love spaceship send it into cosmos. This is a okay, first plan of love spaceship. Uh, th but that's the technical plan maybe. And this is the second plan. So it, it, it will be the love rocket that we will send into the outer s space. That is aesthetical uh, plan. So imagine that the love will be sent with this rocket to the the cosmos and hopefully other species other civilizations can get it and can share it and enjoy it and they can like reprofit this fantastic thing which we as a human people have in general we have like too much love on earth you know and we have to send some we have to share it mm. because too much love is not good Continuing our experimental researches with my good friend, famous psychiatrist colleague, we discovered actually that too much love can kill you. Love is good, 
passion and affection is good, but too much love, you will see the result. That is one of our shelter underground laboratories in Vienna, Austria. And that is one of our experimental volunteers. You can see that there is no life inside him anymore. Look, just emptiness. That is what happens when it's too much love. So, continuing our research on the love matters, as you already know, it's the most important affection for human beings. It's something what we would like to export and share with other species. Uh, but, as you also know, too much love it's not good. You can kill someone. There is also another danger when there is not enough love. Together with a friend of mine, a quantum physician uh, specialized in cosmogony, we just found uh, the location uh, which had not enough love. This is what not enough love means. Very salty, not enough love is.